What is the most painful part of the body to get tattooed? Your genitals. <laughs> I don't have mine tattooed, but it sounds reasonable. Well, you know, nobody should get tattoos because they suck, they hurt, and nobody should get them. Well, I got my head all blasted, and that, that, that didn't feel too good. Yeah. Head tap bros. Head, head tap bros for life. No brain, no pain, right? It's not the spot, it's the artist. Yeah. It also depends on uh, how long how long you're in. You know, if you're seven hours deep, anywhere on the body is gonna start to get sore and hurt. Any tattoo legs. he does on me. The general rules of thumb are the butt, the stomach, the ribs. It's, oh man, the older you get, the worse it is. It that is. is. I mean, some people say the elbow hurts really bad, but like, some people say it doesn't hurt at all. I guess it's a little personal preference, honestly. For what I have tattooed on me, my stomach and my neck were probably the most uh, insane spots to get tattooed. The spots that definitely made me like, you know, question my existence and my career path and doing this to other people. Roof of the mouth. <laughs> what? I'm just putting it out there, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, you said, what was he tattooing, a grundle or something? Dude, my, that, so, that's the taint. So yeah, that's to get it straight. Gooch. There's many words for it. Dude, man, I'm tattooed, I'm tattooed into Isn't my ass crack, crack and that was bad. Gun oh, shit. Yeah, the ass crack was fucking oh, rowdy. That's a good character named Grundle. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Beowulf. He's just like Beowulf a long, Grendel. he's a long Grendel. skin line with a gun. Grundle. For me, my kneecaps and behind my kneecaps are probably the worst. Ooh, the, the back hurt. of my knee ditch though. That was like, like I had PTSD after that tattoo. <laughs> the side of the neck. <sighs> Nothing comes close to the side of the neck just for me personally. Nothing, mm. else, nothing else compared. It almost ruined tattoos for me for a little while. Yeah. I didn't get we tattooed for a while after that. I will say, having my butt tattooed, like nothing, nothing. Everything pales in comparison to My foot was the worst. I want to kick him in the face. Yo, you have, your, you have your ass cracked tattooed? Yeah, yeah, it's, yeah, it's in there, man. That was rowdy. What is yeah. that? And like where your butt cheek meets your thigh was real fucked, man. Like my jaw was pretty bad. I it's don't like, like really any weird, tattoos. But it's weird spots. Back, back, back of the knees? How's the back of your knees? Back of the knees bad, but dude, where your butt cheek meets your thigh is a fucking another it's level bad. of sadness. So I mean, that's the most pel like pelvic area Seven above your junk. Sucks, dude. I didn't Anywhere near your nipples to me, sucks. Color in a nipple, nah. I'm coming up on my 40s and I'm like, I got three years to finish all this bodysuit, man. I'm done. I'm never getting tattooed again. From personal experience, my least favorite spot getting tattooed was the knuckles of my toes. It felt like I was having lightning like tattooed into my body and like just electricity going through my whole body. I got tattooed by Josh Duffy and like he did like one little line that comes like onto my shoulder and I was like fucking shit. Like I don't even want to do my chest. Like it hurts so bad. The armpits. I, I'm doing a full body on this guy. He never even twitched in any place. When I, tat when I finished tattooing his armpit, he cried like a baby for 10 minutes. Like the things I thought were gonna hurt, like my hands, they were, they were a piece of cake. But Liar. my ankle, that was a nightmare. In my experience, cause I'm a wimp, I think the ankle, I know it's like lame, like sternum, meh, back of the ear, whatever. But ribs, I don't know, the back of the ankle, I can't see it. I don't know what's going on. I wanna punch you, but you're too far away. It's not like when they're tattooing your elbow or like your armpit or something and you're like, okay, cool, I can actually punch you. Definitely around the rib cage area, sternum, stomach. I thought that was my worst. I've seen people just have a bad time on their heads. Personally, it was back in my head. Um, the only tattoo that I literally couldn't sit there for. I mean, every time the guy would pull a line, I would, I would stand up, like, nope, I'm out. <laughs> um, but when I tattoo people, it seems to be like lower fingers, like the lower knuckles, the pinky, lower, like pinky. When I started, my teacher told me, you know, wherever it can feel really nice is where it's gonna feel the worst. Everything. I hate being tattooed. It's a love-hate relationship for me. Like, I love having tattoos, but I hate getting them done. Um, probably, I'm gonna pick two places because they both suck. Just under the bum and on the ribs. Both hurt, one's nerve, one bone. Like, it all hurts. I'd say fingers suck, like, real bad. And I made dudes cry, like, tattooing their, like, like this area here, like the like the sides, the love handles. I know that like armpit can be really hard. It's different for everybody too. So like sternums can be worse for for dudes than it is for women sometimes. But like armpits are notoriously bad. Anywhere like on the stomach is just hot fire. So I'm a fucking asshole and went from my belly button to the tops of my thighs, all the way the fuck across, and got six inch giant gangster letters that say unholy, because I have an endless need to piss off my mother, apparently. <laughs> if like your Italian Nana 
was really into black metal, that's like the kind of font it's in. Yeah. You remember back when Matt Driscoll <laughs> fucking know. like acided off his nails for Kelly Doty to tattoo to his fingertips? What? Oh, yeah. yeah, bro, People he got did. his fingernails removed so Kelly could tattoo all the way down to the tips. God, Collectors. This conversation <laughs> is over. Change, change the <laughs> fucking subject, dude. Anthony just ate breakfast and we're about to see it. The worst thing I ever experienced was being burned on 30% of my body. So every time I get tattooed, regardless of how much it hurts, I just think, I've already been through the worst pain possible and I was fine. So even though it may hurt a lot, I know I can take it in comparison. Okay, so I um, I always tell you, uh, you know, deciding how what hurts the most is like deciding who's got the best pizza, who's got the best food. Everybody, you know, some people like pizza, some people like tacos. But like for me, this specific palm, it's a single pass palm. I cried when I got this done. <laughs> um, I've only cried once, <laughs> and I've only passed out once. And uh, I cried when I got this one done. <laughs> and the video went on YouTube. A couple years later, uh, it's on World's Dumbest, right? They make this song that every time I'm like, ah! they go, cause you're a pussy. So <laughs> Uh, and it was a really meaningful tattoo. So like, I was like emotionally vulnerable and shit. Ah! And this hurt like somebody was carving it into my soul. So that wasn't the only TV. Then a couple years later, after I had done Ink Master and all that, um, Ridiculousness or MTV calls and they're like, we want to use your thing on Ridiculousness. And I was like, fuck you people. I know how you production motherfuckers work. I'm not taking less than X amount of dollars. So like we had, I had to negotiate because the world's dumbest hurt my feelings. They called me a pussy so much. I didn't want people hurting my feelings again, man. So that one was kind of funny. So I'll get texts randomly or like Facebook messages. Hey, were you on Ridiculousness? Were you on World's Dumbest? Because of all the fucking reruns and shit. So yeah, taken out of context, it's just some idiot guy crying his dick off getting his, his palm tattooed. <laughs> if you give me a good enough high five and you see me wince, it's because it's so much scar tissue in there because it stayed so well one shot that like if I slap it too hard against a wall or a hand, it hurts still. Yeah, like this, one, this, was, this was tattooed on my soul. And it was a meaningful one, so I guess it was supposed to be. Anybody that says they've really been tattooed, oh, I've been too tattooed, and but just look at their palms. If their palms aren't tattooed, they haven't been tattooed. I don't give a fuck. You're not really trying to get a nice tattoo in your palms. You're just like trying to get tattooed to go, I'm a tattooer, you know? Like, I always say, like, when people ask that, like, you know, what's it's the different. worst? It's Everybody's it's person different. to person. Yeah. Like, some people have gotten chest pieces done, and like, you know, it's the worst I've ever experienced. Other people get chest pieces done, they're like, that was a, a cakewalk. To me, though, I say there's like the golden three, the three that like kind of across the spectrum most people agree is probably the back of the kneecap, um, your like, you know, uh, armpit, and the armpit is really terrible, and usually somewhere around like the center or somewhat the sides of the throat tend to be that most people agree that's like pretty up there as far as like threshold pain. I see the middle, sternum, the, middle of the sternum, yeah. the little armpit flap, yep. canna, you know, yeah. fatty part right there, yeah. for sure. It's, it's, it's person to person, but yeah, it's like there's like, Basically, like when you do it enough, if someone says like they're, they're coming to get an outline of a sleeve, you can be like, they'd be like, oh, well, is it gonna hurt? I go, it's probably gonna hurt a little around the wrist, probably the ditch in the elbow and the top of the shoulder. And Everything in, yeah, right underneath. Everything in between, yeah. Yeah, fine, it's no big deal. People have have brought this up a lot, and I, what I've realized is that every tattoo that you get is gonna have a dime-sized spot in it that's the worst spot of that part of the body. As far as whether the tip of the ankle bone or the tip of the knuckle is worse. You can't really say. They're both 10, you know what I mean? And there's probably about 15 locations like that throughout the body, and uh, you usually experience them in the context of a larger tattoo, where most of it's okay, and then you get to that spot where you're like, whoa! Uh, we've got a bunch of those, yeah, and they're mostly bony, and a lot of them are right down the middle here, or right down the middle of the lower back. There's a couple of them there. you got your toes, your knuckles, your ankle bones, your wrist bones, that little guy there, that little guy there, you got these guys. And then you got a couple just downright tender spots that aren't bony, you know, your ditches, your knee ditches, um, that place where you go around the horizon into the ass crack, place where the cheek ends and the leg begins, you've got some extremely high dense nerve areas that uh, just suck. So there's a lot of them, but I can't say there's a single one.